okay it's working prototype of the battery box and everything should be in battery I'm still not sure so it's a good place but let's keep it in here for the time being oh yeah, let's keep it here it takes too long to thinking about it but because it should be lithium battery I wanna make it heated and I wanna make it heated not by electricity it can be easier yes you have you have to heat when you wanna charge so when you have empty battery how to charge if it's empty okay maybe it's a bit messy explanation but okay I wanna make it heated so by just from the tea from the hot air will going through this hole and going up to heat the battery I don't know if it works or not but let's try it so I have to build a kind of like a heating channel on the back because here will be batteries so here this tray batteries hot air from the warm air from the bottom going up yes so I have to build a kind of channel to tell the truth maybe not okay this is back of this battery box and I wanna connect this to that yeah but like that <laughs> okay and I wanna do it quickly not like a fiddling half a day for it let's try to figure out something Let's will be under 45 degree. So seven and a half. So okay, here we have this will be, will be made from like a let's say steel sheet, and this piece I make from kind of ply, eight mil let's say, bank, drill the hole, bank, bank. Of course, I need like a. So problem is I don't have a bender here, so I have bent somehow. So it will be like I don't want to chop it in the pieces and, and weld everything. So let's try to do. And of course, we have to add one centimeter on the side.
I think we can treat it with a review of this Parkside Nibbler. It's a dirt cheap Nibbler. It's a not 40 quid in a shop. It's nothing. The cheapest Nibbler is around other brands, of course, maybe better, are around 150. So it's a hard to buy tool, such a tool, if you want to make one or two job for 100. 50 quid, but, but for, not for 100, 150 quid, but uh, for 40 quid is a different story. Let's because I pro probably will be problem to get the spin later on. The spin are worn after some time. You have to replace it. This is maybe you can buy it in Germany, but who knows? If you can buy it here. Okay, let's try it. I don't know how <laughs> much is on the on the camera because it's moving from the like a vibration, but it works like that. It's quite simply, quite fast. The edges is, of course, it's not perfect, but much more smooth than with jigsaw or something. Of course, you can you should file it, but it's see, it's okay and. Uh, much better, let's say, for like a zinc plated, because in, with zinc plated you can't you you cannot use the plasma cutter because it starts burning the uh, thing. So right now, I think it's worth this 40 quid. Problem will be in the future with this pin because I suppose it will be not to buy. So. Of course, it's only 14 sheets of, of metal. I think it's like a 1.2 for steel and 2 for aluminium, something like that. And of course, it creates some mess. Ay, 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 ay. Okay, different story.
Looks a little true, not bad. Just like a, <laughs> I well it from the run, so not clean metal, not nice cut. Totally true. Not bad. Of course, what much easier was to use like a standard T with blank, etc. But problem is, today is a Friday afternoon, so means I don't get it till who knows next Thursday, because Monday everything is closed. So it means I can stuck with this work. So I decide to do it by myself. <laughs> Thank you. 
maybe a bit stupid place but here is a main beam just like that and here is a like a sm short cross support to the skirt here just like a, so I can go maybe two mil maybe uh, maybe five mil but I don't want to cut it even so it's a <laughs> maybe looks stupid but it's it's as is uh, to tell the truth I try to find better place but I not found <laughs>